Farmers battled against a dry growing season in the Northland, but it didn't stop one local farm from producing a good quality yield of pumpkins this fall. We're headed to Farmer Doug's Pumpkin Patch in this week's Great Outdoors. We know that sooner or later the frost is going to come for keeps. At Farmer Doug's farm, Mother Nature gets the final say during the great fall harvest. We're really lucky and blessed that we were able to get through this uh, last cold weather spell without any damage. Right now you'll find family, friends and neighbors strolling through a sea of orange gourds. Since all of our uh, normal fall festivals have been canceled this year, we've kind of ramped it up a little bit here at the farm where we can have people come and pick their own pumpkin out of the patch. Hey, hold tight. Old fashioned family fun taking center stage as many look to get outdoors amid a year full of social distancing. And we sell them now because by the time we get to October 1st, we're usually getting a really heavy freeze and any pumpkin still on the field will be mush, will be junk. This year, the Hofbauer family is helping provide scientific research with the cream of their crop. Something special this year is we did a trial with the University of Minnesota where we looked at five varieties. We were looking for something that's early enough to make it here that would give us a 40 pound pumpkin and have good disease resistance. But with science set aside, Doug depends on dozens of smiles to help him get through the next two seasons. I just like to see a kid smile and to me it's important for, for that to happen. It's only about a mile from our house. Whether you're close or far away, families such as the Romanos from Hermantown are happy to make lasting memories as autumn awakens. We hope to decorate them and then uh, have a couple smaller ones to make pumpkin pie with. From tasty traditions to life lessons, spending a day at the farm yields success for those eager to learn. Well, I think they enjoy it more when they know where it comes from and how it grows and then they appreciate it more as well. Our goal is to make our farm your farm. So if you want to come out here and see what we do and how we do it, you could take a little walk around here and look at the different things. Farmer Doug is happy to share his 40 plus years of knowledge with customers creating excitement in the wild world of agriculture. Kids today don't have a direct connection to the farm very often like they did when I was a kid. Do you think you can pick it up? <laughs> at Farmer Doug's with photojournalist Marcus Asmus, Brett Scott, Fox 21 Local News. If you'd like to pick your own pumpkin at Farmer Dogs, you still have two weekends to do so. They're open Friday, Saturday, and Sunday from 9 until 4 through September the 27th. And if fall isn't your season, the Hofbauers have plenty of fresh-cut trees ready to uh, help you celebrate the holiday season.